hey people there so this is going to be a kind of study vlog and also i'll be sharing with you people how i usually study for long hours i prefer starting my day with some things that make me feel good since these days i have no college so i prefer starting my day with 5 minutes of warm up about 10 minutes of yoga and 10 minutes of exercise and while doing all this stuff i spend more than 15 minutes of time talking to myself which is the most important thing you can do if you think that i give some time to my fitness every day you are on wrong path It's only during these days that I am able to manage time for everything. Anyways, after some days I have my final exams and this time I'm going to focus more on biochemistry, physiology, embryology and histology as I've done gross anatomy at least once. Generally whenever I have to study for long hours I divide my time into three study sessions. So by the time I started my first study session it was already late because it was Sunday so I woke up late. And to avoid distraction mujhe jitna bhi phone use karna tha wo main padhai shuru karne se pehle use kar chuki thi. I was studying blood groups and I just found out that transfusion reaction can also occur due to storage of blood that leads to formation of certain endotoxins and cytokines that contaminates blood and so transfusion reaction occurs. Today I decided to study physiology and today I want to complete hematology, CGS, general physiology and applied job upper limb. My first study session averages to 2 and 1/2 to 3 and 1/2 hour and I prefer taking mini breaks whenever required. but yes it's important to make sure that you don't extend this mini break to a major break otherwise it would create a problem for you finally i completed my first study session and it's time for 10 to 15 minutes of break also one more important thing during this break time i try to avoid using phone and i prefer spending some time in the open air this really helps not only my but anyone's mind to feel good again my second study session averages to approximately 3 hours and not more than that in my first study session i completed most of the hematology and the rest of it in the second one and now i have started with the cvs My second study session usually occurs in the evening time so by the time I have completed 3 hours of studying it's time for the dinner. By now I have completed blood and most of the CVS now general physiology and upper limb applied are only left. A few moments later. I have had my dinner and go for the longest study session now. Usually I prefer studying late night so I prefer keeping the longest study session after the dinner. I started with the left out portion of CVS and then I'll go for the general physiology. To avoid getting tired you can change your place of study in between for some time. I've completed all three units of physiology and mujhe upper limb padhne ka bilkul bhi mann nahi hai so I'll go for applied of lower limb and then if I'll get time I'll study applied of thorax also Another point to keep in mind it's important to change the topic of studying if you are not interested in studying that topic on a particular day but you can do this only and only if it's not urgent to study that topic Anyways I started with applied of lower limb and I soon completed it so I decided to go for the applied of thorax now One more important thing to take notice of it's really important to drink water in between again and again and also do some stretching exercises it will boost your oxygen levels and you won't feel sleepy It's too cold here and I am feeling sleepy now however I continued studying applied of thorax But then finally I reached my saturation level and I started dozing off It was an indication to close the books and I did the same. I started winding up everything and ek cheez to bata nahi rahi gayi. My last study session was only of 3 to 3 and half hours today kyunki maine aaj 9 ghante padha hai. Whenever I study for 10 to 12 hours, my last study session includes 4 to 5 hours of study. It's already too late now so I end the vlog here.